Sekhmet is the goddess of vengeance in Egyptian mythology. She is represented as a woman with a lioness head. The name Sekhmet means the powerful one. According to some versions, she was the daughter of Ra, the sun god. Therefore, she is also identified as a sun goddess. Ra begot Sekhmet to punish men who refused to obey the god's designs. The lioness goddess descended from heaven to earth and began to enforce Ra's vengeance on men. The goddess was ruthless with those who were unfaithful to Ra. Sekhmet spread terrible diseases and devoured Ra's enemies. However, the goddess took delight in bloodshed. The goddess's bloodlust was so great that Sekhmet began to guide her rage against the innocent. Ra became worried when he realized his daughter was out of control. To diminish her desire for blood, he devised a plan. Ra offered wine to the lioness goddess. She, thinking it was blood because of the color, drank the wine with pleasure. The drink calmed the goddess, and the sun god took her back to heaven. Sekhmet was also considered a warrior goddess and defender of Egypt. Egyptian soldiers believed that Sekhmet fought alongside them against Egypt's enemies. After bloody battles, the priests who accompanied the army held ceremonies to thank the lioness goddess for her protection. These ceremonies also soothed the goddess and showed that more bloodshed was unnecessary. Sekhmet was also considered the pharaoh's protector. She was always at the ruler's side until the day of his death when she escorted him to the entrance of the other world. When a hot wind blew, the Egyptians believed it to be the lioness goddess's breath. Capable of breeding disease to punish her enemies, she could also stop any sickness. Therefore, the Egyptians begged Sekhmet to cure them. For this reason, the goddess also had the epithet Lady of Life. The city of Memphis was the center of worship of the goddess. On the last day of the year, a great festival was held in honor of the goddess. This celebration was paired with a lot of wine, as they wished to please Sekhmet and avoid the wrath of the powerful goddess of vengeance.